All right, what is up? This is Slow Plays, and guys, we got some big news and an official confirmation here that there will be some type of trailer slash new footage being shown at the New York Comic Con event that will be next month on October 12th. I want to go over the information with y'all and what you guys can expect. Maybe we'll go over a little bit of speculation as well, okay? So, they posted this, okay? As time has passed since, you know, they first announced this event, uh, they have been slowly but surely updating uh, the website and everything uh, to give us a little bit more context and information because we kind of were left in the dark. We didn't know if it was going to be like an actual like full on trailer type of deal or what. OK, was it just going to be an announcement? They were going to sit there and just tell us were they going to just show a picture? No, they, they literally confirm mysterious new footage. OK, which, like I said, we'll go over here. So the actual event, if you are attending, it will be lasting from October 12th to the 15th. Um, there'll be a lot of, you know, in-person stuff that you can do, like certain demos, uh, you know, hands-on experience and stuff, okay? So Dragon Ball is headed to New York for the International Pop Culture Festival, New York Comic Con 2023. We're setting up a special page on this site to bring you the latest info on this exhibition, okay? So the big thing that we want to focus on here is the panel discussion part, okay? Find out the latest info on what's coming to the world of Dragon Ball complete with some very mysterious new footage okay so anybody that has some doubts on this being something um i'm just gonna say i think i think it's safe to be excited okay if you were doubting that this was gonna be anything like special or whatever i'm not confirming that it is you know a hundred percent related to the anime but i'm i'm pretty sure there's some type of anime you know related animation related type of deal here with whatever they're revealing. Now, I do not think at all that this is going to be the Dragon Ball Super anime returning. That's I don't think that's what this is. I think this most likely, okay, this could be that web anime that people have been talking about a lot, okay? I feel like that's the most likely situation. All the leaks that have been going on, uh, you know, since I think like last year or like, I don't know, I don't even remember when it started. It's been so long, but they kept saying that it would be coming, you know, not coming out, but getting an announcement for 2023, okay? So this could be that. This could be that, right? But like I said, it's saying latest info on what's coming to the world of Dragon Ball, okay? The world of Dragon Ball. I don't think this is a video game, all right? And they're saying complete with some very mysterious new footage. Like... I'm just telling you how I feel. I, I feel like this is some type of anime related content. Okay. Some series, maybe what? I don't know, man. Like it just, it just screaming to me. Like this is, this is something really important for the next, you know, step in the world of Dragon Ball, right? They're saying it right there. Okay. Now, again, I, I don't know what the, what this, for example, this web anime could even be. Okay. I've seen some leaks and uh you know people saying what it is or whatever and again like i i don't even we don't even know if the web anime is 100 percent coming okay i'm just this is all just speculation right but <laughs> from what i saw and again i don't I, I i just saw a couple of things um these tweets got deleted and stuff i'm not gonna say exactly what it is because i want you guys to if 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 okay if this is it i want you guys to you know see it for yourself but don't get too excited okay I know that sounds really bad, but like I want everyone to be excited. I want to, you know, I'm excited. I'm personally excited. If, if this is what this is, okay? I'm saying if, not saying this is what it is. I'm just saying if, okay? Um, like I said, it, it's not, it's not the Dragon Ball Super anime returning or anything. It's not that, but, um, I don't know. I'm just, if it happens, if this is what it is, you'll see it and you guys can formulate your opinions on it. If I'm going to keep saying that if this is what that is, okay? Um, I doubt that they're gonna, like I said, they're gonna announce some type of video game thing. I doubt it's gonna be Tenkaichi 4. It just, it just doesn't seem like the place for a video game type of announcement. Do you understand what I'm saying? Like, I know Comic Con is pop culture and all that stuff, but it's just like, I, I feel like we don't really see, if they're, if they're coming through and doing a full panel, okay, it's gotta be something related to the anime. Some type of anime related material, okay? And I think that this web series, if this is what it is, makes a lot of sense because as you guys know, One Piece is going on right now. It's kind of in, you know, I think the manga is like in its final stages and everything. And obviously, you know, the anime 
is catching up and everything. So I think it's good for them to just go ahead and focus on One Piece, finish off One Piece, be done with it, okay? And then put all their efforts into Dragon Ball. Okay, obviously they have a, they can have other series going on at the same time. What Digi? I don't fucking know if they're still doing Digimon, uh, whatever, whatever else that Toei works on. I, I have no idea what else Toei's been working on. When I think of Toei right now, I just think of One Piece because I feel like they're just going full on with One Piece, right? But just like One Piece has gotten all the love. Okay, I want to see Dragon Ball get all the love, and, and I want their full focus on Dragon Ball. Okay, if Dragon Ball is coming back, you know, in the future, I don't care if it's in a year from now, two years from now, five years from now, ten years from now. I'm going to fucking be there, and I want them to actually put in the effort for this Moro, Granola, arc, and whatever else is coming. Because these arcs are really cool, okay? I know people hate certain things about those arcs, and, you know, they have their issues or whatever, but the, the actual... What we're here for in terms of the Dragon Ball, the crazy fight scenes and all that shit, you know, all that, we we want to see that full focus, right? So I want them to cook, let them cook, but for now, give us something, you know, hold us off, right? Hold us off. It doesn't have to be a big, massive, major series, you know? I'm cool with the slice of life shit, okay, if that's what they're going to do with this. I don't know, but I'm just saying, I want to see some type of anime content, you know, give me some Dragon Ball, give it, give it to me, <laughs> give me this shit, all right? Because if if they are doing some type of anime-related material, you can expect that shit to drop in the video games, okay? Because that helps with the video games, that helps with the merch and all that stuff, okay? I want that. I want to see that. I want to see the video games get some new stuff, okay? New content, okay? They got to work off of whatever is a movie or anime-related shit. You, got, you guys get what I'm saying? They're not doing any of the manga stuff yet, okay? Until that gets adapted into the anime, we won't see that in the video games yet. So moving on here, um, this is just the last little segment. Uh, this is exactly, exactly like what they did for San Diego Comic Con. That playable Xenoverse 2 demo is back, all right? It's back. And we already, I, I was initially skeptical on like what this was. This right here, I know people see a picture of the Xenoverse 2 logo and they're like, oh my God, finally new DLC. Not yet, y'all, not yet. We don't know when that the next update is coming, but... Um, it's just a demo, okay? Hands-on previews in a live demo. Dragon Ball Super Card Game Fusion World Trading Card Game coming in 2024 will have a live demo. Now, I'm assuming that's the digital version. I assume, but I could be wrong. Uh, also, we have building demos for figure, rise, standard, plastic models, and you can play demos for Xenoverse 2 and more. On top of that, they'll be giving out some Comic-Con bags with the Beast Skull Hunt uh, headsets. Again, what they had. Uh, Comic-Con exclusive figures on sale and much more to get excited about. Be sure to check the page. Um, okay, if we go to the page, you can see all the uh, specific info. Uh, again, for the time, it's going to be October 12th on Thursday from 12.45 to 1.45, okay? This is the panel. The panel is going to be an hour long, okay? So they could be going over uh, extra info and all that stuff. Probably, at the, I don't know, maybe at the start or at the end. It could be this. They could, at the start, show off the teaser and then kind of uh, explain it. That would make the most sense because they got to explain what this is because, again, if this is, for example, you know, this web anime or whatever, and if the leaks are true on what it is, they obviously got to explain, like, what the hell's going on, like, what this is about and all that stuff, obviously, right? Um, but, yeah, an hour-long panel is great, okay? that We'll, we'll be eating, right? We're going to be eating. And, th like I said, this is just the panel, okay? And then the exhibition, the in-person sh shit, you have all these, you know, things, Tamashii Nation. Yeah, you guys know how it is, okay? Obviously, Dokkan and Legends will be there and stuff, you know, the usual, et cetera, et cetera, right? I oh, wait, hold on. Oh, okay, so here it is. Here we got the... It's not actually the digital version. All right, so, yeah, it's going to be the physical card game, which has all that new art and everything. Fusion World, oh, shit. Figure Rise Standard, blah, blah, blah. Okay, so here's... For those of you that are interested, I mean, we... We're interested in Xenoverse 2. We're the Xenoverse 2 channel. You already know, right? So what this is, is you get to play as Beast Gohan, Orange Piccolo, Gamma 1, and Gamma 2. That's it. <laughs> That's literally it. So again, still, still riding off the hype of DLC 16 that was released May, May of this year. Five months ago, bro. Like four or five months ago. That's crazy. All right. That's going to be it for this information. Um, for, for everything that I wanted to go over, like I said, with you know, disregarding speculation and everything, just know something, something special is coming to the world of Dragon Ball with mysterious new footage, okay? So most likely some new trailer, some new teaser, 
I'm excited, man. I'm excited. Let me know your thoughts and opinions down below. Like, subscribe, ring the notification bell, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace. <laughs> this is Broly, and you are watching Slow Plays. Make sure to subscribe, or else I'll destroy your entire planet. <laughs>